Hello world, my name is Aaron and I'm a developer evangelist here at WebEx. Today, I'm gonna to be talking about WebEx API's meetings endpoint. Specifically, this is my third video in a series talking about all of the CRUD operations where we'll be talking about how to make a HTTP put request to the WebEx API's meetings endpoint. Uh, this could be used to programmatically update meeting information from any app uh, that you may be building. So let's jump right in. You will need a developer account or a WebEx account of your own to follow along. And then you'll jump right to the documentation so you can make sure you know how to interact with this endpoint. Let's look for the meetings endpoint. There we go. All right. Thanks for coming back for my third video, by the way. And if you haven't seen the other two videos, make sure you check those out as well. All right. So here we see the put requests method. Okay. And it looks like all our API is expecting for us here is the title of the meeting, um, the meeting's password, its start and end time, and then in order to actually let the API know what meeting we're talking about, um, we're gonna go ahead and pass the meeting ID into the URL. So I've got some info uh, planned out for all of those fields. If you've been watching the series, um, then you know I created a WebEx API meetings, hello world meeting. <laughs> and that's the one that I'm gonna be manipulating today. So let's put the meeting ID there. Let's go ahead and put the password where it goes. <laughs> Typos are always fun. Cool. And now we just need the start and the end time. Cool. So I'm going to leave all of those the same. So you may ask, well, if you just copy and pasted all that, what are you changing? I'm going to go ahead and add a little agenda just so anyone I invite to this meeting knows what's going on. All right, and let's go ahead and send that request off. Cool, and as we can see, everything has stayed the same, but this agenda has been added on. So now it says this meeting will discuss how great WebEx API meetings endpoint is. <laughs> now, if you'd like to try this yourself, you can come right to developer.webex.com and log in with your account. Or if you'd like to do it from scratch, the way it's happening under the hood, you can go over to github.com where we maintain this repository full of all different types of samples. We've got this one called REST API samples where you can see exactly um, how to do all of the CRUD operations for this meetings endpoint. Um, now stay tuned for our next in this series showing you how to delete a meeting. You guys have a great day.